what's up guys welcome to this python tutorial this is the first video of our python pillow tutorial series in which we are going to learn image processing with python using the infamous pillow library so in this video we will learn about the open function this open function is inside the image module which is inside the pillow library so as the name suggests this function lets us open images in Python, but it only opens and identifies the given image file. This is a lazy operation as this function identifies the file, but the file remains open and the actual image data is not read from the file until you try to process the data. So let's start using this function. Let's see what this function can do and let's see how we can use this function. So what I can do is I can define a variable called img and set it equal to image dot open. So this is the open function which is inside the image module and this open function takes one argument which is going to be the file name. So let me first define file name here file name equals this is going to be equal to the file name of the image that we want to open so in my case it's resources slash butterfly dot jpg so now so now if i uh, print this img let's see what we get print img run the code you can see we got an image object. This is a PIL image object that this open function will always return. So let's try to display what our open image has opened up. So if I say img.show run the code, you can see this is my image that has been opened up in my default photo viewing application. And this is the image that I was trying to open. So it has opened up successfully. So if I close it here and get rid of this img.show, what if we mess up the file name? If we input the incorrect file name, let's see what we will get. So if I run the code, uh, you can see we get file not found error. That's because we provided it with wrong file name. So if we input the wrong file name, it will raise an IO error that we are seeing here. So this is it. This is how we can use this open function. So this is it for this video. Give this video a thumbs up. If you have any questions, you can comment down below. Subscribe and see you in the next one.